Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Woody and today we're looking at gear that's been used, tried, tested, gear that we know works. First things first, shout out to Damo from Ran the Fire. Cheers for the awesome t-shirt, it's really great. First item we're looking at is storage. It's really important to us as overlanders to keep our gear easily accessible and safe and secure as well. So, I'm going to show you what we're using and we've been using it for years now. We use RV Storage Solutions. So what we have in the back of the Jeep here is part of their premium series. This is called the Easy Access Combo and it's available in different modular formats. We've gone with the two drawers stacked next to the fridge and then a cargo platform on top. Let's take a closer look. So what we have here is a drawer that's about 275 millimeters tall and in this drawer we keep a lot of our essentials. So first things first is our our first aid kit, which is well equipped for when we need it. Um, High-vis vest, uh, winching gear, so straps, tree trunk protectors, uh, backup winch remotes, and shackles and things like that. Also some airing up and down equipment. Uh, the top drawer, we use that depending on what we're doing. So sometimes there's camera gear in there, sometimes there's uh, pantry items. It really depends on what we need uh, and what we're at to do at that moment. We have it paired with one of the heavy duty fridge slides from RV Storage Solutions. What makes it heavy duty is the travel lock. So that lock there puts pressure on rubber stoppers and it stops the fridge slide from rattling at all during transit. When we pull it out, it locks in position. So I don't know if you can see there properly, but that just stays out there like that. That way, if we're parked on a bit of a decline or an incline, I don't have to hold my fridge slide open and hold my lid open and somehow get all the stuff out. It'll stay where it is, I can get my gear out and then just release the lever and away home it goes again. Throw it in and turn the travel lock. This has a platform on top and you can see there's um, a series of tie down points uh, all the way along there so I can strap cargo to there. Normally we have maybe a portable solar kit. Um, and, and some light gear, so we don't want all our weight up high, so we're throwing things like tables and chairs, maybe uh, blankets, camera equipment, whatever we need it to be when we're packing at that moment. Works really well. I actually use some RV storage solutions components on the trailer as well, I'll quickly show them to you. So once again, another heavy duty fridge slide. Uh, this is really important because um, we don't want things moving around or rattling in the trailer. So same again on there. We also use another RV Storage Solutions fridge slide for our kitchen. Uh, works perfectly. So you know, being a fridge slide is designed to be in the in the back of a moving vehicle off road. It's designed to carry a little bit of weight, so it's perfect for our kitchen module. Uh, one more thing I'll show you about the drawers too. Like the heavy duty fridge slide, it locks out. So I pull that all the way out. That's locked in place. So once again, I don't have to hold the drawer open and get all the stuff out that I need to get out. It's just gonna stay there. And then there's a little lever there. When I'm ready to, I pull that up and it releases the drawer. And it goes all the way home. Now that's been in there, I'd say two, maybe three years now. And I've never had a single issue with it. I've never had to tighten up any bolts because it started making noises. I've never had to grease anything or anything like that. It's super strong, super reliable, and it has a lifetime warranty. And it's Australian made, which is you know really important now more than ever. So that's what it comes to when we're using storage items in the back of our four wheel drives. It keeps everything safe and secure, uh, never have any issues with it, and I can, can't recommend it highly enough. Thank you so much for watching guys. Tune in for the next episode. We're gonna pick another piece of gear that we've used, we've tried, we've tested, and we're gonna give you the rundown on it and what makes it good and how we use it. Thanks for watching.